Let's talk about lethality. It's how armies win wars by overwhelming the enemy with decisive, coordinated force. I'm James Wharton, here on the training area at Catrick, a place synonymous with the infantry. It's where all British infantiers complete their training, and it's home to several frontline battalions. For decades, soldiers here and across the army have trained according to a warfighting doctrine rooted in the Cold War. Well, that's about to change. The Strategic Defence Review suggests a new approach, a warfighting doctrine called 204040. So, what is it? Well, 204040 refers to a future force structure, a breakdown of how the UK will deliver lethality in battle. For the British Army, that means 20% of capability will come from traditional platforms, tanks like Challenger 3, artillery and attack helicopters. But 40% will come from consumable, largely autonomous systems like loitering munitions and kamikaze-style drones, the kind we're seeing in Ukraine. The remaining 40% will be reusable, high-end surveillance and reconnaissance drones, AI-enabled but often human-operated. These will also be able to function autonomously. It's all a dramatic shift in how Britain plans to fight, seen by some as overdue, but by others as unrecognisable. The goal? A tenfold increase in lethality, without significantly growing army numbers. That's one of the headline ambitions of the Strategic Defence Review. General Sir Richard Barons, one of its architects, explains what that could mean for a typical infantry company. If you take, for example, a, today's infantry company, yeah. and you understand how far it can see, how fast it can move, and how much destruction it can deliver. Well, where are we going to go? Crude, uncrewed, autonomous, is, is, it, is it can see further, kill far more, far more often. It's just 10 times more powerful. That it, it's, and it's not a particularly scientific thing. We'll know it when we see it, but, but we, we can see how technology will make a company 10 times more lethal. Now, we've already seen frontline units begin adopting drone technology. When we recently visited one Langs in Estonia, they were using both reusable surveillance drones and single-use attack UAVs just 35 miles away from the Russian border. But the one-way attack drones that we use are literally just built for purpose. They fly, hit a target, and that's them destroyed um, with a small munitions. You know, it's just the way the, the world's moving now. We've seen with current conflicts in Ukraine and um, in other parts of the world as well that, that this is the sort of avenue that conflict's going now. To make 204040 a reality, the MOD will spend at least 10% of its budget on drones and emerging technologies, what it calls novel capabilities. This isn't just generational change, it's absolutely fundamental. If the force makes the leap to 204040, the British Army of the future will look and fight very differently. So what do you think? Will this transform British lethality? Or is it a step too far? Let us know. Thanks for watching. For more from BFBS Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.